The FAA releasing its final instructions for airlines to ensure those planes are repaired and safe. A 12-hour inspection process to examine MAX 9s. The agency laying out an enhanced maintenance process, which will require, among other things, an inspection of specific bolts, guide tracks, and fittings, and detailed visual inspections of left and right mid-cabin exit door plugs. Each of the airlines will make sure that these four bolts are properly installed and tighten. Boeing will be helping wherever necessary, but each of these airlines knows that their reputation is on the line to make sure that those airplanes are safe to fly. United saying it's putting the planes back in the air by Sunday, with Alaska Airlines saying their 65 MAX 9 jets will be up Friday. All this following three weeks of investigations into that door plug that flew off the Alaska Airlines flight 16,000 feet in the air. Boeing still facing scrutiny. The FAA telling the company it can't expand on production of the MAXs beyond what's already being built until there's a full investigation. Meanwhile, Boeing CEO Dave Calhoun voluntarily traveling to Capitol Hill, taking tough questions from senators. We fly safe planes. We don't Easy put cuts. airplanes in the air that we don't have 100% confidence in. Reporters asking Calhoun about a Seattle Times report claiming that the door plug was actually last installed by Boeing, not the fuselage manufacturer Spirit Aerosystems. Thank yeah. that no, thanks so much. Boeing telling ABC News all updates on the investigation must come from the NTSB. Again, that was Ike Jachi reporting there.